Hello everyone, and thanks for joining me here. My name, of course, is Mr. Mocha Lover, and right now, we are waiting to drop a, uh, syndicalist bomb, a totalist bomb, on the Rift in Northern Africa. I'm joined here by my cup of coffee that I just made, and my stopwatch, to make sure I don't go over too much of the time limit, or keep this episode within 30 to 35 minutes. Anyways, um, let's continue on. Right now, what we are currently doing, though, we're currently in Korea, and I just told, I think it was this guy, Maurice Rose, to move his booty and his men over to southern Korea. So that way, we can uh, add more units, more, add more divisions up to China when we actually get to that border, and uh, yeah, have a good time. <clears throat> Basically, have a good time. Uh, I think we are building more infrastructure in northern Korea. Yes, we are. Thank God. Uh, oh, I don't have a national folk. What am I doing? No wonder I'm getting negative 1.4 political power a day. Wow, holy crap. Improving relations in the commune of France. Uh, occupations really hurt me. I lose over three political power a day because of occupations. But I'm going to go construction engineering so that we can build stuff up faster. And I'm going to stop boosting my relations with the commune of France since uh, we really like each other. We really like each other. We're almost going to get married, but maybe not that much. Also... In Massachusetts, we made another fleet, which has two dreadnoughts now, two cruisers, and 13, what do we call it? 13, yeah, destroyers. Yeah, that's a D word. Yeah. Ah, uh, cool. Hugh Muslak, pretty good guy. Oh, I didn't, I've never seen this. This is the first time I've ever clicked on, so he's a blockade runner, he can be a, become a sea wolf, huh? But right now, we can do a mine layer, which I don't, I'm not, I don't ever use mines. Mine Sweeper, which I don't ever sweep mines, and Concealment Expert, so we get less visibility. I like that one. Oh, smoke screen. Retreat Decision Chance. Well, Fleet Speed While Retreating, Convoy Speed While Retreating, Retreat Decision Chance, plus 20%, plus 25%, sounds like a great idea. I've never seen this before. Maybe I should pay more attention to the DLC. <sighs> this is cool. Ironside. Air experience, spotter. That is okay at spotting, I suppose. Uh, superior tacticians, pretty low. Fleet protectors, okay. Not great, but very, very interesting. Uh, right now, let's go on patrol. That'll be good. We don't really need to do any more naval invasions for now. Uh, we're just slowly missing the atomic bomb go off in Africa. Because their allies failed to do anything. Alright, well, whatever. So be it. I mean, you don't really expect much from our allies. Not too much. Ooh, there's a Japanese fleet around here. Oh, an armored heavy cruiser. Thank you very much. And thank you very much for your destroyer. I appreciate it. Tanks, 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 tanks. How are you doing? We're just trying to get up to the front line. That's all we're trying to do right now. Very nice, very, very nice. Push them out, push them out of the way. We have taken the first piece of Chinese land. Which is awesome, awesome, awesome. I did check on the Chinese divisions, like the Feng Chiang government's de de decisions. No, not decisions, divisions. And they're like, generally 12 width. They're not, they're not really 20 width, usually. They're just, they're pretty thin. And by thin, I mean less than 20. Anywhere between 8 to 16 to 18, maybe. Whoa, we lost two destroyers. Our fleets met up. I sunk a dreadnought, a fast battleship, and two armored cruisers, five cruisers, and then four destroyers. Great. We didn't lose too much. Only destroyers. So go ahead. Tell everyone else to repair. And that's why I like putting a lot of destroyers in each one of these task forces. So if you lose two, it doesn't matter. No one cares. So that's always good, 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 good. North Co Northern Korea is slowly getting better and better infrastructure, I hope. May 7th will be done. Awesome. 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 Uh, now I say destroyer has been sunk. How many ships does Japan even have left? Promoted. We will go to war with Australasian Confederation eventually. Union, whatever it's called. See, Transamir doesn't have a bunch of ships. They have some. A little bit of manpower. Feng Chin government. Uh, quite a bit of manpower. Two ships. Quite a few divisions. And Japan has up to 20 ships. A couple divisions and no manpower. Great, I love it. And with us pushing as hard as we possibly are, we should be doing okay against the enemies here. Now, I do want to capitulate the Transamir Republic, or the Far Eastern Republic, eventually. 
Uh, how is this all looking actually right now? You guys are just four tanks. You're balanced, you guys are balanced, and you guys are... Uh, don't be extreme, just be balanced. That would be great. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Good, good, good. Not too bad, we got some decisions. Public recognition of the Philippine exile government and work with anarcho Spanish allies. Ooh. Yeah, why not? And the Iberian Federation has agreed and we get some political power. Awesome. Thank you very much, my anarcho Spanish friends. Oh, have we secluded Port Arthur away from everyone else? I love it. Great, 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 great. And I'm not forgetting, no. Last time I said we would begin an invasion of Northern Africa for ourselves. Uh, so... I'm actually going to take my subs and use them to do what we need to do. For now, let's actually, before we do anything else, let's go ahead and make another sub task force. Subs, where are you babies? There you go. 62 is probably a little bit too much. Let's go to, uh, actually, since we're sending them to Africa, or close to Africa, you guys will be based in Nova Scotia. Why not? Nova the Scotia. Great. Great, 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 great. You guys... Um. Cool. And actually, don't come over there. You're moving over to Lisbon. Great, 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 great. Yep, we have definitely arrived in this part of China. And Dong, I suppose that's that part of China. Uh, our radar eventually will be really good, so I'm not going to build it. Oh, well, actually, I'm going to build it up here in Port Arthur if I can. That would be really great. And build up an airport here, too. Oh, there it is. A pretty good airport anyways. Nice. Uh, let's go back to here. Let's grab a couple more Coast Guards. Since I wasn't planning on invading China right now, but we probably need to anyways. Or, you know, covet China or whatever we do to China. Uh, guys still not over there. Where are y'all? Don't tell me you're all sunk. No, you're, you're almost there. You're pretty much in the Asian sphere. Of influence. How are our allies? They did make an encirclement last time. It looks like the French are just trying to push in as hard as possible, at least in the southern portion, but they're not really moving up very far or just doing anything. I think they're probably more focused on taking out Mashriq, which will, of course, be a problem. And oh my goodness, is it laggy? We do have some air superiority. Maybe we'll make sure that we have air superiority here. And of course, with air superiority, you gotta have a couple of bombos. Bombarinos. Alright. Our guys are in Lisbon. They are ready to go to do whatever we need them to do. We have better engineering companies. Better signal companies? Sure, because why not? And then you guys. Alright, so one, two. Almeria. Oran. And then you two will come from Almeria. Two right there. I want to put six divisions per every harbor I, or you know port I want to take. So there goes six. Come from Malaga, attack here. And you two come from here, attack here. We're sending twelve guys at once. Uh, attack there as well, even though you probably won't make it. Oh. Can I only send 10 at a time? No. Okay, cool. Come to the Malaga. 1, 4, 5, 6, 7. Come to Almeria. Okay, maybe not. Okay, game, you don't want me to put them over there? I see what you want me to do. Alright, uh, let's see. These guys are the only ones not moving. Whatever. Come to Gibraltar, I guess. And actually, right now, let's do this. Manage subject, no, occupy territories. <clears throat> let's lower Japan's occupation cost. Let's be a little bit more gentle. 694 factories, and now 662. How did that hurt us? Well, not too badly, actually. Factory-wise, yeah, it really didn't hurt us that much, so. That's actually not a bad decision to take. So now we only lose, we get 1.07. Political power day, great. 
Oh, we sunk five or six enemy ships. Nice. Great job, guys. I was just looking. Our soldiers are getting closer and closer to moving up here. The Chinese just cannot push us back. I love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Uh, oh, yeah, there's Feng Chan. That's why they call the government Feng Chan. Or whatever. Air superiority, yeah. They have more, way more planes than us, but uh, yeah, we are doing a pretty good job with what we're doing. Guys are in the water. Getting closer. It is a little laggy, so I can't expect too much at the moment. Uh, the Beijing government is only 17% of the way to its capitulation. Do we need to drop the Totalist Bomb? I think so. Let's get the port. Let's see what happens. Don't stop attacking before I can keep bombing in them. Come on. Basra. Ooh. Oh, that helped. That definitely helped. The Japanese divisions almost all died. I love it. Uh, can we nuke their capital? Oh, we might as well do that. We don't need too many... I'm not going to use nuclear bombs against uh, China, but just because infrastructure probably already is not very good. Uh, bomb Kuwait, just because uh, they have a port. I don't want them getting more supplies. Uh, let's see. We need more air superiority to do that there. Um, maybe I'll save the other bomb. We don't have to use them all at the same time. So... Not bad, not bad. How are the tanks? Maybe I should just tell the tanks to go to the right. Maybe try to capture Vladivostok. That might be a good goal for us. Who knows, once we get Vladivostok, maybe they'll capitulate, maybe they won't. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Uh, let's see, we got a lot of good equipment. Jesus, this is really good. A lot, a lot of good stuff here. Oh, and we're out of Chromium. Um, what's Indies Federation? Soviet Russia, Bharatiya Commune. Most people don't want to trade with us. Or we can't find for trading venue. Oh, hey, Brazil, thanks. Ooh, an improved snorkel, better subs. Yes, daddy. <clears throat> Feng Jin. Since we're trading with both the West Indies as well as Brazil, let's build up infrastructure that they cannot use. Yeah, great idea. Yeah, let's do that too. Love it. And we are attacking. I just don't think that the Chinese have very many supplies. I just want all of you guys to get here. Just just move. Just go. It's alright, guys. They'll understand. Alright, we... Ooh, there's a couple of Japanese ships down here. But we sunk two of them. Fast battleship, as well as an ACR, or armored heavy cruiser. Uh, I forgot that we had a nuke Ireland, too. Sorry if you're Irish. But not really. Nothing says Dublin like a couple pair of nukes. Alright. And are our ships here yet? No, they are not. We have a motorized division in Lisbon and nothing else. And I do have to say, but we'll build more nukes before we actually invade, because I might nuke North Africa again. Ooh, two subs in Transamur. We have taken that area. Great, great, great. Go here, all the way over to there. I'll give you a couple of seconds before you do it. All right, good enough. Ooh, two more Transamur subs. How close is Transamir to capitulating? They are not that close. Oh my goodness. Even though they're not really a major power, I think just because there's so much land, we do have to take them out. They're only 21% of the way towards capitulation, which really sucks. We have to get all the way up there. I'm glad I'm sending another army group over here. Go ahead and do that. I'm actually going to position you down here now. Ooh, I did move height key over here as well. So. Go ahead. Everyone stop. Reorganize yourselves because... This is going to be a long time before we get all finished. And actually, I'm going to send you now over to this side, too. There you go. So, it's your job this time, Oliver Law, to make it over here. Good luck. Good luck. That's all I really got to say. Um, guys? You want to go? No? Okay, well, whatever. Just tell everyone else to go, then. Cool. Oh, we're trying to take Beijing now. Even though we don't have all the front line covered yet. Or we're running out of space for our front line. Uh, you might as well move up. Benjamin Katine, you have anything for me? No siree. Alright, alright. Our Socialist Republic of Turkestan is doing not bad. 
Uh, who knows? Maybe I'll attack the sign of coalition before we're all done with this campaign. Maybe, maybe not. I do know that it's been a since I started a BitChute account. It has been a little difficult to upload one of my videos, most notably uh, the episode 27 of this campaign just refuses to be published or something. I'm not really sure. It just seems very odd that I don't know why I won't want to be published, but, you know, whatever, I guess. Ooh, uh, let's build advanced heavy carrier next. I need to do anti-air. Oh, this is why they're, they can't push in, because there's so many enemies around there. Ah, uh, very nice. Uh, for this stuff, uh, I'm just going to treat it the same way as I did with Japan. For the most part. China, I really don't care about your stuff. Just be gentle with them. Be gentle with them. Be gentle with them. All right, release a nation. Why would I ever release? Game rule. Countries can never release nations? Huh. I did not know that. Return territory. Federal. Uh, probably not. West Indies Federation. Puerto Rico. Sorry, that's kind of American at the moment. Convoy. Convoy. Good. 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 So now since we added 30 more divisions, these guys should be pretty good as helping to close some holes. Where, where are the extra dockyards? Why do I have extra dockyards? I don't even have enough steel for all those extra dockyards. Cool, thanks, Argentine Commune. Just don't revolt against me. Hmm. Uh, occupied territories. Yeah, they're all on gentle. I haven't made any more naval dockyards. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hmm. Uh, I guess we'll have another carrier then. Alright, whatever. I don't really care. Sounds good to me. Where's Massachusetts? There you are. About 5,000 convoys. Not bad, not bad. I need to mow the lawn after I'm done here, but you know what? That's okay. You guys get a little more crazy. You guys get a little more crazy as well. And Tisa. Hmm, what are you going to do? Oh, I guess we took Beijing, I suppose. You guys, go ahead and take these Chinese divisions out and come back to the rest of the line. You guys can move. Actually, you guys probably don't need to move. Yeah, I'll, you, these two take them out. John Tiza. Maybe I should take out this area too. The Legation Cities, guaranteed by the Australasian Confederation, which might be good to start a war with the Legation Cities, so that way we go to war with Australasia. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting thoughts and ideas. Alright, are our subs back here yet? Yes, they are. Thank you very much. Well, most of them are. I want you to patrol here. Yeah, pretty much just there. Yeah, do some convoy rating. See what you can find. Because Sardinia is still part of the former Entente. And they need to be taken out. They might be sending supplies to North Africa. North Africa might be sending supplies to them. You never know, so... See what happens if we find anything, we blow them up. If we don't find anything, you know, whatever. Not bad, not bad. I mean, the, the subs I'm making aren't extremely great, but they're not bad. Auto-saving takes quite a while, and that's okay. I really want to nuke you. Really want to do that. Alright, cool. We have definitely made one hell of an entry into East Asia. Jesus Christ. This is awesome. Ooh, did we lose something? Oh, actually, we shot down an enemy plane. Uh, what is the air superiority like here? We sunk 40, holy crap, 40 Japanese convoys. That's pretty awesome, actually. Uh, here, add 400 more heavy fighters just in case. And you'll come to the Tyrian Sea. I know I put them in the wrong place, but whatever. Doesn't really matter. I trust my divisions in Asia to do a good job. I mean... The Chinese divisions really can't stand up to American divisions. Maybe nowadays, but I don't know. We'll see what happens. You guys come here. Oh, 11 Irish convoys. Great. Actually, you know what? Once I get up there, I'm going to split these guys in half and send half to Sicily. So they can help cover the central Mediterranean as well. Great. <clears throat> great, 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 great. It looks like we are encountering quite a few enemy convoys, which is kind of... Kind of awesome. 39 more have been sunk. Jesus. 40 in total, with another 32 Siamese convoys just obliterated. Uh, I really don't want to nuke. I don't have air superiority, so I'm not going to. Ooh, what's this? 40? Oh, Jesus, 40 more? Goodness gracious. 
They have so many convoys here. Oh, and it looks like our allies are now trying to push heavily into the Feng Shui government. Great. Ah, gotta love coffee. I almost said water, but it's coffee. You might as well help out. Oh, we got... Oh, two more tank divisions. Awesome! Oh my goodness. 20, 32 more Siamese convoys or Thai convoys. Five more Turkish convoys. Or maybe Mashri convoys. I'm not really sure. Uh, five more... Who is this? Maybe it's Yemen. Maybe it's Yemen convoys. That's what it was, probably. 25 more Siamese or Thai convoys. Jesus. It's the Kingdom of Siam right now, I believe. Yeah, Kingdom of Siam. Great, great, great. Oh, it's so laggy. Transamir, you gotta be getting killed here. Yeah, you're unscraping the barrel. Banshee government. How are the divisions that have been trying to move to Asia? Where are you guys? Oh, you're right around Japan. Cool, cool, cool. Looks like there wasn't a circlement, and it looks like people are no longer there. Great, love it. Oh man, we could potentially split China in half if we get to the Shangqing Tianguo country side. Because we could split off what was known as Mongolia and Manchuria with the rest of central and southern China. Well, I guess ocean central, ocean south China, because technically Yunnan clique is geographically Chinese. But, you know. Very nice. Oh, baby. Tell me the rewards. 35 Japanese convoys sunk. 32 more Siamese convoys sunk. Caligari? Cal Caligari? Cool. You know what? Screw it. We'll nuke it. Just because... Get rid of Sardinia. They have a lot, they have a lot of divisions. Holy cow. Or at least it looks like they have a lot of divisions. Ah, very nice. And you still can't take it. God dang it. Let's see. Scraping the barrel. They have barely any steel. And not much manpower. Modern sub -hole. Great. Capital ships. Tell me. Advanced super heavy gunnery. I love it. And it's that time again, my friends. Time to upgrade our subs. With a level 2 snorkel. With better torpedoes. Oh, baby, level 4. Yes, please, daddy. Level 5 subs, level 4 torpedoes, followed up, actually this time, radar might be really useful. Get more sub detection, which doesn't matter, more reliability, but how about anti-air? We have no anti-air, we might as well get a thing of anti-air on there since we can use it now. So that's actually not too bad. I want you to come to, yeah, it's Nova Scotia, we'll make two of those immediately. Nova de Scotia. And put on the other two subs to be one and one. There you go. <clears throat> there you go. Nice. Oh, baby, what do we do here? Ah, cruiser has been sunk. Awesome. Good job, guys. 32 more Siamese convoys, two more French convoys, one more Sardinian convoy, two more French convoys, followed up by 32 more Siamese convoys, and then 35 more Japanese convoys. Screw it, just nuke this place too. Oh, I should have nuked this place. Whatever, it doesn't really matter. Alright, so what we're gonna... Uh, well, I'm gonna wait for a few more nukes, and then I will definitely invade. <clears throat> they have about four divisions there. I'm gonna nuke the hell out of that area before, when we get there. The French currently have about the same amount of manpower as we left them. Alright, interesting, interesting. Alright, alright. Asia is looking... Maybe Asian? I don't know. Cool, we got another army group here. Actually, what? Oh my goodness. Oh, if I split them up though, then that's not good. I'm actually going to tell you guys to come down here next. Wait, have we already split up? All right, so we got to call an audible here. So you guys are over there. You guys are over there. So actually, I'm going to put you under someone else. You guys are on. The right. So actually, you're gonna come over here. You gotta split these two armies up in half. I'm glad I already made you. Do that. Do that. You're on the right. While everyone else is gonna be facing the southern portion. 
Alright, that's good. That's good. We have a battle plan. And actually, if we split up China now, I'm okay with that. Just tell them to go ahead. It doesn't really matter to me. Better signal companies means we can reinforce in battle quicker than normal than probably our enemies can because I've never seen the AI or very rarely have I seen the enemy AI use signal companies so we probably have the higher initiative to reinforce some battle and get more supplies faster. Mmm. Coffee's not bad. Mmm. Oh yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good. And those divisions will be wiped out. Oh, Ron. I wish I knew how many divisions were over in Oran. Uh, if I can get at least Oran, that would be okay. But they do have quite a few divisions all over this place. Give me one more nuke, and I'll, then I'll definitely invade North Africa. One more nuke. Just one more nuke. How's this looking? Too many divisions in one spot. I hate having so many allies that just eat up all the supply. It's incredibly annoying. Tanks. You probably honestly need a break. Just go ahead and have a break for now. Have a Kit Kat break. You know, have a Snickers. You know, something like that. 32. Nice. Casualties. Honestly, pretty awesome for us. 191,000. We lost quite a few ships early on, but other than that, it wasn't too bad. Oh, they are attacking. Oh, we're attacking them. They're kind of attacking us, but they're not exactly winning. Good. I like that. John Tiza, are you here yet? No, you're not. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. I just It's going to take a while to capitulate all the places around here. Oh, they're kind of attacking us. We're kind of helping attack them. For you guys, just be careful, alright? Our guys do need help, so you might as well be, try to be careful. Nice, and that'll definitely solidify their control. Go this direction, because they need help now. Ezra Scurry, you're still level 1, which is a little disappointing, but Nathan Butler's level 2, which is good. Uh, Chesty Puller, do you have anything for us? No, that's okay. You take your time, Chesty. Heidke, Maurice Rose, yeah, I don't think you have anything. And then you guys, ooh, Lewis Campbell might have something. Disappointment! Oh, right, you have disappointment. Thanks, Lewis Campbell. Um, nope. Alright, well, whatever. 32, 32, 3. Great. We're getting close. We're getting close for me to invade North Africa. My attempt to no invade North Africa, of course. So we'll see, definitely see what happens. Do you need a field marshal, really? Uh, we got enough political power. We can do that, probably. Nathan Butler. I think I'm already using you. Ah, Braxton Baxter. Oh, my goodness. Give me that Baxter guy. He's an artillery specialist. Oh, I guess if he was a general. Oh, he can be an aggressive assaulter? Oh, hell yeah. He has artillery specialist experience, uh, factor 100%, and more attacking and planning. I love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Cartagena. Never been there. Never been to Europe. Oh, all right, guys. We almost have another nuke. We can almost go. Uh, let's see. <clears throat> they have two divisions here already. Yeah, taking these areas will be kind of difficult. Obviously, I will probably be able to land in areas that the enemies have no divisions in. But we will see. <clears throat> as long as I can make a solid beach landing and then be able to uh, hold my ground, then the allies, our allies will swarm in, destroy any sort of good infrastructure that we have, and, yeah, basically get us pushed out. All right, let's go. Uh, let's switch to naval escorting. Nice. Is that it? Cool. Go ahead and nuke the bejesus out of the Rif and Oran. All right, the Americans are coming. Better watch out, bitches. Oh, baby, it's nice and bright in Africa tonight. Oh, yes. And there we go. Uh, you guys, I would have loved to give you more force attack, but whatever. Uh, we're not winning there. Uh, even though I nuked them, and a lot of their strength is really just gone. Uh, ooh, advanced super heavy gunnery. S modern super heavy gunnery. I love it. Can someone win? Oh, we won there. Tell you guys to push this way. Actually, tell both of you to push this way so we can at least land in a harbor. Because we don't 
win in one of these areas, at least we can take Oran. Yeah, they're they're crushing them in Oran, which is great, great, great. And once they're gone, come on, great. Go ahead and push this way down too now. At least we have landed somewhere relatively safe. Now I'm going to put U8 down here. Great carrier battle groups. We're done with our naval doctrine. It only took me until 1948. Let's get not an advanced carrier hull, but a something. Better ways to survive. I like that. Ooh, Ch uh, Chinese ship. We have pushed up against the Chinese here. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And we split China in two. Wow. Welcome to America. And actually, just go ahead and be added to whatever is already over here. And since this is our land here that we took from them, I can build this area up to our liking. Finally, thank the Lord. Praise the ammunition. And spread totalism. Good, 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 good. Just get as many guys in there without killing the infrastructure. We're going to land very soon and help attack Oran. Good job, guys. Now they're getting attacked. They're getting attacked. I don't have another nuke. I could really use another nuke, though. Oh, another encirclement. Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, please. Nice. If we can take the city over here. I forget what this is. The Riff. That'd be awesome. Great job, guys. Uh, take one of you guys. Just hold the area here. And we've landed. We have gotten a massive beachhead down here, which is great. It only took our allies forever, and not a not being able to do it, to do it. Go ahead and uh, blow the hell out of their ships. Uh, you know what's good? Do, do patrol. Do patrol. Great job, guys. We did what our allies could not do. And the beginning of the end has arrived for the Kingdom of France. Yeah, baby. Awesome. You are really good, George H. Cannon. You've done a great job. You've done a good thing for America, but more importantly, you've done a great thing for the world. As well as all the soldiers currently fighting land wars in Asia, which you should probably avoid at all costs. But regardless, that is all the time for that we have today. We have invaded North Africa. We have split China in two, which sounds radically crazy if you think about it. And yeah, our allies are just being dumber than rocks by not being able to advance anywhere because of their supply and infrastructure problems. Well, with that in mind, guys, thank you very much for watching, guys. Leave a like if you like the video. Subscribe if you're new. And I will see you tomorrow on either YouTube or BitChute. Thanks for watching.